What are we doing right now, Chris? <laughs> we're uh, removing the very dirty water from the ballast something. so we can flip it over and repair this awful damage from it breaking off the anchor and hitting the rocks. I didn't feel like I was doing enough. The tragedy happened. I went to the vigil and I realized that more of my friends could possibly die and I could have been in that fire myself. So I realized that the art community needed more art. There's two murals I'm aware of. One that had MS-13 scrawled over the face of the, the mill that died in the Mission District, which actually repaired the other night. And then there's a, another beautiful ghost ship mural. But I wanted something that was highly visible that went out on an anniversary and would play along with some of the art and culture of this area. This area is well known for uh, Robert Harris, I think his name is, he put Snoopies and such up and down this stretch of the highway. Right over there you can see the Red Baron. Snoopy used to be on the end of the pier, but he fell off and the remnants are right there. <laughs> so I wanted to join in on that, find a very highly visible spot, do something that would distract me from all the tragedy. I think of it as a pirate ship, just so that it can make me jolly as opposed to and uh, something that would remind a lot of people of what happened so that we don't relive it. I'm gonna come back later. Yeah, this was the uh, state The ghost ship's in a constant state of disrepair, I must say, but today we installed a solar-powered LED, so hopefully it holds together and stays waterproof, um, sign on the side that says, go ship, lights up at night. It's a little bit hard to read during the day, I might need a white coating. Hey, your See you around, <laughs> hey, I went to Burning Man uh, a month ago. I spent 36 hours, I think, in the temple, and I met uh, several people from Oakland that had lost people and were leaving names in the, uh, in the temple. And I just, I, I mentioned the ghost ship, and they all knew it, <laughs> and they loved it. And that just meant so much to me. So, uh, art for the artist community, you know? I want to see more of it out here. I want to see other people contributing. I want to see art up and down the freeway and everywhere it shouldn't be and should be and just representing what we're here for the artist of Oakland memorials are meant for pain and suffering like you let it out you need some healing you got to release that anger otherwise it'll build up in you and destroy you it's one reason I created this art took a lot of that and put it into something that I thought would you know there's all my anger. <laughs>